Attention all stations, this is the NLM on the NLM net. I'll be conducting the final launch poll for the SMAP mission. Uh, we are in good shape. Uh, launch vehicle is processing uh, no issues at this time. Spacecraft is healthy. The range is clear. We have good weather. We are managing upper level wind data at this time. It is red currently. However, we have prospects with additional balloon data that will come in between now and T0 that will turn that uh, green to give us an opportunity uh, when that balloon data comes in. So we'll, I will now proceed with the uh, final launch pole, beginning with NASA CE. NASA CE, go. SMA. SMA is go. SMD. SMD is go. NASA MIM. NASA MIM, go. NAM. NAM is ready. NLM copies, the NASA team is ready for SMAP launch. Cycling locks tank vent. SSP, vent N2 sphere prior to the end of the hold is required to maintain N2 reg press within limits. Roger. Prop 2, activate and display record on change list, engine underscore start. Roger. Cycle locks fill and drain valve three times, verify talkbacks and report complete. Roger. Zone drain cycle is complete. Copy. Cancel display and deactivate. Record on change list. Engine underscore start. Roger. This is Delta Launch Control, T minus four minutes in holding. We just received an out brief on the latest upper level wind situation that upper level winds are now green. We are green for a 622 liftoff, our upper level winds in the latest uh, balloon run and the analysis of that data means that that uh, information is being placed aboard the Delta II rocket into the guidance system and we will be lifting off at 622 this morning. Upper level winds are green. Final pulse coming up to take us out of the built-in hold at T minus four. T minus seven minutes. Status is checked to proceed with terminal count. Report go, no go. Talker. Go. FSC. Go. Prop one. Go. Prop two. Go. PEA. Go. EEA. Go. VP. Go. SCM. Go. SYS. Go. FAC. Go. ATC three. Go. Timer. Go. HYE. Go. FMA. Go. SSC. Go. SSP. Go. TM1. Go. TM2. Go. VE. Go. ATC2. Go. VSE. Go. OSM. Go. FACA. Go. GE. Go. RC. Clear to proceed. NASA TM. Go. USO. Go. AC. Go. Launch Director. LC, this is LD. You have permission to launch. Roger. Proceeding with the count. Node personnel switch to channel 15 after liftoff is confirmed for pad securing. SYS, established launch sequence and engine start. Record on change list, activated. Roger. FAC, verify booster engine section GN2 press is 1200 PSIG minimum. Verified. Secure EB HVAC units ACU1 and ACU2. Roger. FAC, verify manifold press is 160 to 185 PSIG. Verified. This is NSC. The spacecraft is configured for launch. Roger. After liftoff, we'll be hearing our telemetry manager, Steve Agat, calling the flight events. LC, established countdown limit conditions, T minus four minutes on. On. All personnel stand by for release of the hold. All steps prior to the terminal count are complete. 
pick the hole, pick up the hole is in four, three, two, one, T minus T four minutes, minutes and counting. FAC pad water system enable. Enable. GN two purge on. On. SSC transfer vehicle electronics internal. Active. First stage internal. Second stage internal. Internal. FAC divert AC flows. Roger. Prop one, bent helium umbilical as follows. Roger. T e minus three minutes. Prop one, vehicle fuel tank press open. Open. Fuel umbilical purge open. Open. SSC, armed vehicle ordnance systems. Active. First stage armed. Stage armed. Second stage armed, armed. FSC, bat one, heater control, exit. Exit. Bat two, heater control, exit. Excellent. Hydraulic enables on. T minus two minutes. SSC, FTS, bat one and two heaters off. Off. Prop one, pressurize vehicle ox tank. Pressurizing. FAC, establish pulse suppression water on. Roger. T minus 95 seconds. 90 seconds. SSC, hydraulic external power on. External. HYE, check hydraulic pressure, go. Go. 80 seconds. Dropping to 100%. Seventy seconds. SSC, hydraulics internal. Internal. T minus 60. We're at T Round minus three. one minute and counting. Range is green. LC, T minus 60 second limits on. On. Water flow. Full of flight. Flight. ATC3, main power dis. 30. T minus 30 seconds. Go Delta. Go SMAP. Stable on. On. 100% LUX. 35. Hydraulics are go. Four, three, two, one. Main engines start and lift off of the Delta II rocket with SMAP, making global observations of soil moisture for climate forecast. Good chamber pressure on the main engine. Good chamber pressure on both vernier engines. The chamber pressure on all three solids. 27 seconds into the flight. Coming up 46 seconds, still looking good. 50 seconds in, Max Q. Vehicle uh, now having maximum dynamic pressure in the vehicle. 57 seconds. Chamber pressure beginning to decline on the solids, as expected. And we have burnout of the solids. We'll be holding on to those solids for about 30 more seconds to assure a safe water impact point. One minute, 12 seconds into the flight. Still looking good. One minute, 25 seconds, chamber pressure holding in the main engine and in both verniers. One minute, 30 seconds. Standing by for separation. And we have separation. 
of the solid rocket motors. The uh, Delta II vehicle now only weighs one half of what it did at launch, expelling propellant at the rate of 799 pounds per second. One minute, 55 seconds in. Two minutes, five seconds in. Chamber pressure continuing to hold on the main engine and on both verniers. Two minutes, 17 seconds in. Good engine control in the first stage. A little engine corrections are needed in uh, either the main engine or both verniers. Passing two minutes, 30 seconds. Vehicle continuing to accelerate. Passing a Mach 5, vehicle going in excess of uh, five times the speed of sound at two minutes, 55 seconds in. Up on the three minute mark. Mark, three minutes into the flight, chamber pressure continues to hold very well in the first stage on the main engine and on both verniers.